Hello, I'm Jody Wolf, and you're watching Expose. It is May 15, 2018, 11, 11 p.m. in Birmingham. Guys, I'm doing this blog uh, for two reasons. One, I've just got a couple things I want to say, and, and one person that made a comment, um, Diane, I want her to hear this because I think it's important for the church to know who their friends are and who they're not. Let me say this. If you recall, Netanyahu went to visit Putin last week and or week before, late week before last, like Friday and uh to tell Putin that he's not going to stand by and let Iran continue to pound at Israel and Israel not do more than just strike those places that are hitting Israel from Syria. Putin stood down. I don't know if you all know that. And... Putin also told Netanyahu, this is after the IDF took out more batteries in Syria that were of Iran. He notified Putin. That's two contacts on Putin. And then a third time. But this time, Putin contacted Netanyahu. This one made me feel like the things I have been saying about Putin may be true. If you recall, I said he claims to be a Christian. He was raised by a Jewish mother and father, whether I, I'm not sure they were his. I don't believe they were his, but Jewish family raised him. This is Putin. Putin may stand closer to Israel than you think. Putin told Netanyahu just prior to Netanyahu on the last strike against Iran and Syria, he says to Net, uh, put into Netanyahu, he said, I will not deploy the S-300 defense system in Syria as long as Iran continues to do what they're doing to you. Guys, did y'all hear that? That's a huge, huge statement. Now, there's a study and I'll have to find out which one it was, and uh, I can get that information for you. People trying to figure out Gog of Magog. Who are they? Well, this gentleman's digging deeper and deeper into it and going back, really way back. Gog of Magog is not Russia. It is the... If you're in Turkey, looking at Turkey from Israel, you're looking to the north. At the far right, which is the far eastern and the far northern parts of Turkey, that is Gog, guys. And those peoples around that area that saturates down into Turkey's Magog. Turkey is Gog of Magog. Turkey is about five of those names that are mentioned of the countries that will go against Israel. The guy said, I have proof on that. And he's doing a study on it. And I listened to it with intent excitement because I'm taking Putin's word that he is a Christian and that he would not do that or go after Israel. I don't believe, look, you have to go with me here 
Just think about it. If you know, and and you're going to go in and try to destroy Israel, and you know you're going to die that night, are you going to go in? Of course you're not. Those who will go in, they're not thinking Jesus Christ. They're thinking Allah and Muhammad. They're not thinking God of creation, the thinking Allah, a moon rock, and Muhammad, a line prof, a, 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 whatever he is, he's a liar. But I'm, I'm saying that I believe that Putin's military, even in that day, could be hijacked by the majority Muslim army. I don't think Putin will be the one to go against Israel. And another thing, John Kerry and Obama, you know, that trip they've been making all the way through the Middle East, trying to get all these countries to stand up against America and make that deal go through. Now I know why. There was a 5% royalty on it if it went through. And guess who is a part of it? Merkel is. You got Kerry, you got Obama, you got Merkel, and you got two other partners. They share five billion dollars. That's right. <laughs> I had said in an earlier blog that they have a monetary gain there. This is why they're fighting so hard to not let Trump stop that $150 billion gift. That's because all of them would stand to pocket a billion dollars, guys. I said it, and I think it can be confirmed today. Jody Wolf exposed.